everyone. My name is Andrea Vinay, and for those of you who may have seen some fun holiday videos posted by either myself or my UNF percussion students called the Daolian Days of Christmas, and you're wondering what is this crazy instrument that they are playing, I wanted to make a brief informational video giving an introduction and some background on it because it is quite a unique instrument and has a special story that I'm happy to share. Schwendi and his family in 2015. He inherited the instrument from his father, Royal Schwendi. Bruce and I actually met in a bluegrass band that we played in together, and after we got to know each other, he approached me and asked me if I wanted to have this organ chime instrument that he'd had in his basement for over 50 years. And of course, as a percussionist who likes crazy instruments, without hesitation, I said yes. And I had no idea what it was or what he was talking about or how big it was, or if it would even fit in my house. <laughs> and I'm so glad that I said yes, because it's, it's such a special and beautiful sounding instrument. You can see we've got shiny steel bars, and the same C is the second lowest C on a marimba. And then we have all the way up. The name of the instrument that I gave it is Daolian, which is a combo of Aeolian and Delorean. The organ chime instrument was made by the Aeolian Organ Company, which is no longer in business, sadly. And the year that I was given the instrument, which is 2015, was the year that Marty McFly and Doc went back to the future. So to commemorate that special year, I blended Aeolian with DeLorean, which is the vehicle they traveled in time with, to get Daolian. So that's what that means. This organ chime instrument was originally part of a pipe organ in a church. And Bruce's father, Royal Schwendi, was a member of a congregation in upstate New York. And in the 1970s, the organ needed repaired and it was beyond repair, so they actually took it out. And Bruce's father salvaged all the pieces that made up this instrument and made a makeshift frame for it. The organ chime instrument is actually installed inside of the organ. It's mounted vertically and the notes are in a different configuration than the resonators. And then it's struck with leather covered hammers that are controlled by the organist's keyboard console. While visiting the George Eastman House in Rochester, New York, I was able to catch a glimpse of the Daolian's long lost cousin in the museum's Aeolian organ. <laughs> on the patents imprinted onto the bars and it is three and a half octaves the lowest note is a C and that C is the same as the second lowest C on a marimba and the uh, bars are made of steel and the resonators are made of brass the instrument is tuned at A435 so it's a bit flat compared to your standard keyboard percussion instruments like marimbas and vibraphones which are tuned at A442 so it doesn't play well with others not quite, it's more of a standalone instrument. However, it does work with tuned gongs and cowbells. <laughs> so you'll definitely see those combos in our holiday videos. <laughs> that seems to work and it's fun. <laughs> to 
percussion builder MacGyver extraordinaire Brian Stotts, who built the beautiful frame that it is on now. It's, it's very, very posh, and this enabled it to be concert and stage ready. So after I moved to Jacksonville in 2017, the Daolian had its stage debut, concert debut, if you will, um, and I premiered a piece written by my former student Dylan Staley, and that was a really special time to be able to introduce this instrument, share it with the community in, in sort of a formal setting. Since that point, we've used it on several performances here in concerts, and of course it is the main inspiration for the Daolian Days of Christmas, which uh, has turned into quite the event here at UNF in December. <laughs> My students and I just get together and we literally make stuff up on the spot and improvise and come up with holiday tunes and have a good time. And so it's really special for me to share that with my students and for us to be able to spread some joy to people who, you know, enjoy the sound of all these unique instruments. <laughs> with everybody so please stay tuned and follow me and UNF Percussion online because we will continue to make fun videos and write pieces for it and we really hope you enjoy it. Mm -hmm. 